Today we're at the Urban Farm installing our new FAFCO solar hot water heating system. We have a proven track record. We first developed these collectors back in the late 60s. Right now we see a big movement across the country of people actually going back and considering solar energy. Arizona, 300 plus days of sunshine a year, and it fits. This coupled with tax credits, federal, state, and local utility companies, it makes it very affordable for the, uh, for the homeowner. It's a brand new system developed in conjunction with the Department of Energy and the National Renewable Energy Laboratory. It's low profile, low cost, it's flexible, it won't overheat, it's freeze protected, it solves all the inherent issues of past solar water heating systems. An old-fashioned solar water heating system is actually much bigger, much bulkier, and guaranteed it costs significantly more. The major components of the system are the solar collectors, 80 feet of PEX tubing to connect the solar collectors to the water heater, a drain back tank to provide excellent freeze protection, a circulation module that's pre-plumbed that includes two high-end pumps and a heat exchanger, and all the plumbing, all the fittings you need, along with a high-end automated electronic solar controller. And when the sun comes out and there is available solar energy, the system activates. The pumps push water from a tank down by your water heater up to the solar collectors and begin to circulate water through the solar collectors. When the system turns off at night, or if your water heater has reached maximum temperature, all the water that's on your roof circulating through the solar collectors and in your attic, it all drains back into a little tank that's right next to your water heater. A typical uh, hot water heater takes uh, $400 to $500 a year to run. If you can use one of these solar hot water heaters to offset 60 or 80 percent of that, I mean, you're looking at you know, a couple, three, four hundred dollars a year that you could save. You can really get anywhere between 75 and 80 or even more percent of your hot water needs for the year come from our panels. With the federal credits and the state and local credits that are available, you can pay off our system in as little as three or four years. The big reason to do this is if you're considering solar energy as a way to reduce your carbon footprint on the planet, to save yourself some money, this is the technology to look at.